स्टूडेंट्स माय नेम इज़ पूजा अरोड़ा असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर बयानी ग्रुप ऑफ कॉलेजेस ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ गुरु के पी ए डॉट कॉम आई एम गिविंग यू वीडियो लेक्चर ऑन द टॉपिक ऑफ ग्राफ थ्योरी लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड वॉट इज ग्राफ ग्राफ इज वेल यू नो अबाउट इट इट इज़ अ ग्राफिकल रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ डेटा एंड इन डिस्क्रीट मैथ्स वी डिफाइन ग्राफ विद हेल्प ऑफ सेट सो ग्राफ इज अ सेट ऑफ वर्टिस एंड एजेस वी ऑलरेडी डिस्कस द सेट थ्योरी सो यू नो बेटर अबाउट सेट ग्राफ इज अ सेट ऑफ वर्टिस एंड एजेस लेट्स टेक एन एग्जाम्पल इफ आई ड्रॉ लाइक दिस दिस इज अ ग्राफ here 1 2 and 3 vertices and 1 2 and 3 edges let's name it for better understanding i'm naming it it is v1 v2 and v3 i'm naming vertices with v series and edges with e1 e2 and e3 so there are three vertices in my graph v1 v2 and v3 and there are three edges in my graph e1 e2 and e3 edges are nothing but the connection between the vertices is called an edge so uh, if i define this graph mathematically then set of vertices are v1 v2 v3 and set of edges are e1 e2 and e3 so this is a simple example of graph with uh, the set of vertices and set of edges is called a graph so this is a simple example of graph let's have one more example if i say this one and this one this is also a graph i am naming vertices like v1 v2 v3 and v4 and i am naming the edges e1 e2 e3 e4 e5 and then e6 okay in this set of vertices are v1 v2 v3 v4 we are familiar with it and set of edges e1 e2 e3 e4 e5 and e6 there are six edges e1 e2 e3 e4 e5 and this is also an edge a edge who is starting from uh, vertex v4 and ending in the vertex v4 this type of edge this is a special type of edge i am going to discuss there are two type of edges special the first one is called loop and second one is called parallel edges what are that the loop is the uh, edges which start and end with the same vertex means a uh, edge is starting from v4 and ending in ending in v4 this type of edge is called the loop so it is a self loop it is a self loop starting from v4 and ending in v4 okay and this is called loop and what is parallel edge parallel edge is if two edges their starting and ending vertex are same then that that two edges are called parallel edges for example if e1 is from v1 to v2 so if i describe e1 that will be equal to v1 v2 because starting point is v1 and ending point is v2 that is the edge even if there is any other edge like this i am describing one more edge it is even and i am describing e7 here okay so this is a edge even between v1 and v2 and this is a edge e7 here is starting point and ending points are also v1 and v2 so the starting point and ending point of two edges are same then these two edges are called parallel edges even is parallel to e7 so this type of edges are called parallel edges and this type of edges are called loop loop is self loop starting and ending vertex are same parallel edges starting if two uh, edges have starting and ending vertex are same then that two edges are called parallel edges so these are the type of edges and these are the vertices and the combined vertices and edges is called a graph okay and uh, now let's discuss about the degree of the graph degree of the graph what is the degree of the graph degree of the graph is called number of vertices degree of graph is called number of vertices in the graph for example in my first example i have three vertices v1 v2 v3 so the degree of the graph is 3 for this one 
in this v1 v2 v3 v4 there are four vertices then degree of the graph is 4 okay now you get the concept to find the degree you count the number of vertices and that will be equivalent to degree of the graph but what will be the degree of each vertex we can find the degree of each vertex in a graph and let's discuss how can we find the degree of a vertex i am finding degree of vertices okay what is degree of a particular vertex degree of uh, any vertex is number of edges incident from that vertex is called the degree of that vertex for example this is my graph and this is the vertex v1 there are two edges e1 and e2 which are incident from the vertex v1 so degree of v1 is equivalent to 2 so if i found the degree of v1 that will be equivalent to 2 if I found the degree of V2, that will also 2 because there are two edges E1 and E2. If I talk about V3, there are vertices e, uh, edges E2 and E3. So, degree of vertex V3 is also 2. So, in my first example, degree of each vertex is same. Degree of V1 is 2, degree of V2 is 2 and how we find the degree? We count the number of edges incident from that vertex and that will be equivalent to the degree of that vertex. Okay, if I found degree of this graph, degree of vertices in this graph, for example, I am finding degree of V1 in this graph, where is V1? V1 is here. So, I am going to count the number of edges, the one, 1, 2 and 3. So, there are 3 edges, so degree of vertex are 3. If I am talking about V2, number of edges are 1, 2, 3 and 4. So, degree of v2 is 4 degree of v3 what will be the degree of v3 there are only two edges e1 e2 and e3 so there are two degree of vertex 3 and degree of vertex v4 now count the degree of vertex v4 1 2 3 and the loop okay so when we count the degree of any vertex if we have a loop on that vertex that loop is counted twice because once it is starting from the vertex and one it is ending in the in that vertex only so we count the loop twice so uh, if i am counting the degree of vertex v4 it is 1 2 3 and 4 and 5 i am counting loop two times so total uh, degree of vertex v4 will be equivalent to 5 let's take one more example to count the degree of the vertices to make the concept better because it is a very starting point to find the degree of each vertex in any graph i am taking example in which i am having a loop here here i am also having a loop and here i am having a vertex v1 v2 v3 v4 and v5 okay now let's count the degree of each vertex starting with degree of v1 what will be the degree of v1 number of edges 1 and 2 so degree will be 2 Num uh, degree of v2 what will be the degree of v2 1 and 2 and 2 for the loop so total will be equal to 4 so degree of v2 will be 4 okay and degree of v3 degree of v3 is 1 and 2 for the loop so total is 3 and degree of v4 degree of v4 is 1 because there is only one edge incident from v4 so degree of v4 is 1 and we are having one more vertex in my graph that is v5 so what will be the degree of v5 there is no edge uh, connecting to the vertex v5 so there is no edge so the degree is 0 what will be the degree of v5 it will be equivalent to 0 because there is no edge incident from this vertex so in this way we found the degree of each vertex okay and with this we can uh, discuss the type of vertices in a graph as we have already seen the degree we can define the type of vertices type of vertices there are basically four type of vertices the very first is called pendant vertex what is pendant vertex pendant vertex is a vertex whose degree is 1 that vertex is called 
pendant vertex. So, in our example, we have already seen that the vertex V4 has the degree 1. So, in our graph, V4 is a pendant vertex. Okay. And the second vertex uh, type of vertex is called isolated vertex. What is isolated vertex? Any vertex which is isolated from the graph, that is which is not connected to the graph, which has the degree 0. It is not connecting to any edge, any, any way it is not connected to graph. So, this vertex is called isolated vertex. So, in my example, the vertex V5 was an isolated vertex because the degree of V5 is 0. So, uh, this is isolated vertex. The third type of vertex is even vertex. Even vertex is a vertex whose degree is even. So, in my example, if I take V1, degree of V1 is 2. So, it is an even vertex. If I take V2, degree of V2 is 4. So, it is also an even vertex. And the last type of vertex is odd vertex. What is odd vertex? Odd vertex whose degree is odd. So, uh, if I talk about V3, V3 degree is 3. So, it is an odd vertex. So, there are four type of vertices we have seen. The very firstly is pendant vertex. Pendant vertex is nothing but whose degree is 1 is called pendant vertex. There is only one edge uh, incident from that vertex. Okay. And isolated vertex which is completely isolated from the graph because there is no edge connecting graph to the that vertex degree is 0. That graph, uh, that vertex is called isolated vertex. Third, uh, the third one is even vertex. Even vertex whose degree is even is called an even vertex. So, V1 and V2 are even vertex is my example. In odd vertex whose degree is odd number. So, that vertex is called odd vertex. Okay. So, these four are the type of vertices we have seen. Type of edges we have seen uh, loop and parallel edges. The two special type of vertices uh, and other are the simple edges. Connecting two vertices of a graph is called an edge. We have seen the type of vertices and type of edges and now we will discuss the type of graph in my next video. If you like my video, please like, comment and share and don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you so much.